Palestinian school in Qatar. Today we are going to finish our unit with habits with video 6. Please follow. Now my students, don't forget that when the subject is I, we, you, they, we don't add S to the verb. For example, I paint. We finish our work quickly. And when the subject is he, she, it, or we can say singular, we add S to the verb. For example, he paints. When the subject is also singular, or he, she, it, and the verb ends with one of the following letters, S, double S, O, C, H, S, H, or X, we have to add E before S. For example, she finishes her work quickly. Now, my students, please, according to what I have just explained, please read the following sentences, then add S, E, S, or nothing to the verb. Please concentrate on the subject itself also. Take two minutes to do it. Now, please, Pick your answers. Number one, he always cleans his bedroom. We add S because the subject is he. Number two, she never washes her hair in the evening. We add ES because the, the last letter in the verb is sh and the subject is she. Number three, I sometimes help my mom. We don't add anything to the verb because the subject is I. Number four, she always brushes hair. T, we add ES because the, the verb ends with SH and the subject is SHE. Number five, he never goes to school on Saturdays. We add ES because the verb ends with O and the subject is HE. Well done until now. Now, please, take two minutes to continue those sentences to add S, E, S, or nothing to the verb. Take two minutes. Now, check your answers. Number six, I sometimes get up late. We don't add anything to the verb because the subject is I. Number seven, they always play football on Mondays. We don't add anything to the verb because the subject is they. Number eight, they never go to bed early. Also, we don't add anything to the verb because the subject is they. Number nine, we sometimes make a cake. The same, we don't add anything to the verb because the subject is we. Number ten, we always brush our hair. We don't add anything to the verb because the subject is we. Well done. Now your homework for this lesson is 
copying the following sentences in your copybook two times correctly on the lines. Thank you. I hope you understood the lesson. Please revise it and try to spell the words alone. Thank you.